the help center, which has been a new addition. I know those that have been with us for a little while have utilized the actual chat on the front end of the website, which would be this right here. Um, what we're doing now is if you notice in the chat, there is a support chat to use the new help center, which is support.stellarforgemoney.com, knowledge base, EN, all others for sales inquiries can go right here. And then we have the help center button here, which will take you to the actual help center. There's some announcements on the main page you guys can check out. We closed out the new location very quickly within a month. We were already full, so we're already looking at the next space. If you have questions on L7 delivery status inquiries, we have copies of the actual emails back and forth with Bitmain that you can take a look at and you can click there and go to that actual knowledge base article. We will be updating that as we go so that we make sure we have everyone on the same page. For Help Center, go ahead and click Help Center. On here, we have several different areas. We have basics of getting started. We have Stellar FAQs, frequently asked questions. We have sourcing and payments. We have hosting and services, technical support. And then there are top articles right now, which is that pre-order delay for the Antminer L7. So these will be getting built out over time. This is our first time going through. You can either click contact us and go directly to contact us. You can go to login, set up your account for help and support, or you can click on this right here and it is going to take you through the topics as well. And then you can say contact us by email and it will pop up with an actual area for you to go through and put in your subject, your email address, your phone number, first name, last name. And then you're also going to select your ticket type. So whether it's a billing account, reporting a problem, hardware service request, which could be you want something done specifically or other. Any of those are available. We're also going to be adding a few different ticket types as well as we get going with this. And then you describe your issue. So we have an example here. My S19 Pro is showing as inactive. And then you fill out a recaptcha and then you click submit. Okay. So I'm going to draw your attention to technical support right here. Go ahead and click on that. And then you can look at requesting support or technical do-it-yourself guides. Let me show you a do-it-yourself guide. This will be developed over time as we move into the future. Click technical do-it-yourself guides. And we want to walk through how to replace a cooling fan on your amp miner. We're going to have a lot more of these coming up as we go through how to replace uh, battery how to replace power supplies, et cetera, different types of card maintenance so that you can take a look at those. That's a good resource for our community, whether you host with us, buy from us and host with us, or whether you do it on your own, you can click here. And if you notice, these are high quality, high quality actual images showing you the label, what each part of this is on a particular item, what the components names are, what your step one is, what type of instrument you're going to need, whether it's a standard Phillips based head screwdriver or your, if, whether you're going to need a newer refurbished 12 volt 2.3 amp four pin cooling fan, clean tabletop work area, walks you through how to disconnect everything and reconnect it. And then how to put the fan, what order the fan should go in, whether it should be facing a certain direction or not. We've got an airflow diagram as well to show you that. And then also how to connect the machine again and then run through and then some handy tips for getting that complete. So let's go ahead and move back one. We're going to walk you through requesting support. So on here, you can go through if you couldn't find your stuff under the other area that showed you the guides, which that will be building over time. You can walk through and take a look at how to set up and log into your help center account. So your help center account at Stellar Forge Mining is going to be your most important asset that you have. Um, it is going to be the way that you contact us, the way that your uh, things get escalated and all of that. So make sure you go ahead and get this completed. So starting 11 15, 2021, Stellar Forge mining members will need a separate account to request support through the help center. So this is not the account that you buy with, it's the one you're going to request help with. Members will be able to set up and log in to their Stellar Forge help center account and access functions like requesting support, submit troubleshooting tickets, view a ticket status and support conversations. 
and then you're going to get your access through Stellar Forge Mining, and then you can access directly through Help Center. And then as a reminder, you must only submit report requests through the Help Center website, and you may only submit requests for your account. So if you have someone else here with us, because we know a lot of people bring friends, make sure you're only submitting a request for your own account. Submitting support requests elsewhere will not receive a response moving forward. Instructions for access through StellarForgeMining.com. You can go through step one, go here, select the Help Center button at the top right-hand corner of the menu. You can walk through. Step two, select the Login button at the top right corner of the Start menu. Step three, click Sign Up here to set up your Help Center profile. And then opt to sign in with the existing Google or social media account. And then you have a Help Center profile. Step four, fill in the required fields with your information, set up, sign up to create a Help Center profile. And then step five, you will be sent a verification email with instructions to complete verification. And then step six, once you verified your email, you will land on the Stellar Forge Mining Help Center page. To access your Help Center profile, click the profile at the top of the website. We have instructions of, for access directly through the Help Center. You can go through this and learn exactly how you're supposed to do what, how you create your ticket, get your verification, all of that. Okay, We're then going to go back here and talk about how to create a support ticket request. You're able to go through all of this on your own. You can read through this one, how to create a support ticket request. We walk you through instructions for submitting a support ticket, where you go, how to do it, Help Center profile, walk you through step three, step four, and then how to submit your request here. The information you need to include, and then go ahead and upload a file if you have screenshots or documents you wanna give us as well, and then you can go down here and click send. And then step seven, thank you message will, uh, will display for a successful ticket submission click on the Visit Help Center to return to the main page. Okay, and then step eight, an email will be sent to you once the successful ticket has been submitted. Okay, step nine, you can check on the ticket by clicking on the My Profile in the drop down under your Help Center profile in the top right hand corner. And then in your My Profile, you will see My Help Requests, which is all of your ticket submissions and then you will also be able to see the current ticket status, click on a ticket to view the responses, and then you can reply or add additional information here for us as well on things that we uh, maybe did not cover or not. And then if you need to make the circle again and set up your login because you went here first, click on that again and it will take you to that next part of how to set up the login, which is what we just did a couple minutes ago. So this is the beginning of the support center that is available. There will be a lot more do-it-yourself guides. We also move some of these stellar FAQs here as well. And then there's an article on um, sourcing and payments. And we'll have some more information about billing as we go here so that you're able to get your mining operations up and going with ease and also the attention that you need when you need it. And we are strategically positioning the future for us to be able to be as efficient as possible with you and you to have the convenience that you want from us. And we are always open to feedback. We talked with a customer this morning. Um, it was a great conversation. They have uh, quite a few machines with us and we worked out a plan to get the things that they need for them. So if you're one of those, um, we can take care of you too. We'll talk later. Have a great day. Talk soon.